Good morning, Nigerians. Good morning, good people of Edo State. I am Olumide Osaigbovo Akpata, the Labour Party candidate in the upcoming gubernatorial elections in Edo State. It is 2.30 a.m. today, the 13th of April, 2024. I just finished meeting with some of my associates and I was on my way to bed when my staff drew my attention to a video uh, that is making the rounds currently of an individual who claims to have been shot at an event that I attended yesterday, claims to have been shot by security agents at that event. Um, I have looked at the video. Nothing can be further from the truth. I only wish that this individual will show his face so that we can uh, determine the veracity of his story. Because as far as I know, this story varies from actually what happened yesterday. What happened yesterday? I was invited to the University of Benin Senior Staff Club uh, to hold an interactive session with members of that club who are senior staff of that institution. I am told that a similar event occurred at the same club a couple of weeks ago where the PDP uh, candidate in the upcoming Edo election was also the guest of honor. At this event, I spoke extensively with members of the club and uh, we exchanged ideas. To our surprise, and to our consternation, this event was interrupted very rudely by some hoodlums who claimed to be students of the University of Benin. They disrupted the event for well over one hour, insisting that that event ought not to have been held without their being informed. You can imagine how shocked we were. You can imagine how shocked the professors seated there and senior members of staff of the university seated there to be told by strangers because we don't want to believe that those were students of the University of Benin, that they cannot hold or could not hold such an event in their own club without seeking permission from these third parties. This event could not hold, indeed, because of the actions of this student. It was indeed disrupted. They barricaded the premises, the gate to the premises with their vehicle. There was fracas in the precincts of the club, and one lecturer was actually injured in the process. He was wounded seriously in the process, and he is currently in hospital right now uh, as a result of the wounds he sustained. I had to be taken out of the premises by my security personnel, and even as we attempted to leave the Ugbo campus of the University of Benin, we found that the highway had been barricaded by these same hoodlums who attempted to impede our journey and stop us from, uh, from progressing. It took the intervention of my security personnel to actually dislodge this barricade and for us to continue with our, on our journey. We know what is going on. It's election uh, season again in uh, Edo State, and it is quite obvious that some of our old and very tired politicians uh, are up to their usual antics, their usual tricks. They have learned nothing. They will forget nothing. I have it on good authority that these hoodlums were deployed by a senior official of the, of the Edo State government. And I'm speaking directly to this individual now. I know you. You know me. I am no pushover. Labour Party will not be intimidated by you, by your paymasters, or by your minions. If it is your intention to cause mayhem and to cause havoc in Edo State, we will resist you. You will not be allowed to reduce our state to nothingness. You have done enough damage as it were. We will not stand for this. The will of the people will not be subverted. The will of the people must prevail. At the right time, we will make the necessary reports to the uh, police authorities and we will provide for them the information that we have at our disposal regarding this event. For now, let me just place on record that at no time was a student of the University of Benin shot at, shot at or shot or even wounded, at no time did anything of the sort happen. That video is a fabrication. The video making the rounds is a fabrication. It was obviously deployed to, to bring about misinformation. Indeed, I was the one who was attacked. The club was attacked. Professors of the University of Benin were threatened. One lecturer of the University of Benin is in hospital as we speak. I asked my supporters, I asked my friends and my associates, I asked all of you to keep calm. Uh, reason will prevail and peaceful elections we hold in Edo State 
come September 2024 by the grace of Almighty God. Thank you.